Well, good morning. We're here at Volcano Bay. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> I love this park. It's so good. Volcano Bay. They don't allow you to film with GoPros on the ride, so we won't be able to film a lot. We'll film whatever we can, and film some food and stuff. I know what you're having. Yeah, I know what I'm having too. Should we keep it a secret? If they've watched us before, they're gonna know what you're having. Well, here we are, we just got our lunch. We got Scotty's favorite, the longboard Hawaiian pizza and mac and cheese, just cause I'm feeling piggy. And we just met Ryan's travels. He was vlogging around the park, so we said hello to him. So let's dig in. Oh, and also he's got an angry orchard. So all of this, this was about $12.99. That was $10 for the mac and cheese and $10 for the angry orchard. So a little bit expensive, but hey, we're on holiday. I think our eyes were bigger than our belly. It's good job we've got these two here to help us out. The seagull, we call her. When everyone's finished, she starts seagulling. That pizza, though. That pizza dough. That pizza is amazing. What's the hand action? <laughs> well, so far we've ridden Krakatau, which was our first ride. Then we went on and did a few of the raft rides together, but obviously as we can't film very much apart from the river runs. You guys won't see much of it, but we are gonna go in the river run in a bit. So we'll take the GoPro in so you can see us splashing around. Grab my finger. Ah, gotcha. Oh, that was chilly. Oh. <laughs> oh, I don't wanna get wet. <laughs> oh, right in the face. in Volcano Bay, we'll probably come back for a few hours before Horror Nights on a different day. But we really want to go back and shower, ready for tonight, have a good Horror Nights and possibly dinner at Bahama Breeze. Hello again, we're here at Horror Nights. We're gonna do some houses. Scare Try and do some of the houses we haven't done yet, hopefully. Yeah, we haven't done us or Ghostbusters, that would be cool to do, but don't do it, we don't do it, we'll do it another day. but they did a good job recreating all the different scenes and everything. The scenes were really good. And the killer clowns from out of space, that's gotta be up there, one of my top ones, I love that. Yeah, it's really fun. The smells, as you walk in, there's popcorn, and then a cupcake smell as you get further in. And yeah, the big clownzilla at the end is really good too. Yeah, I love it. Coming up to my favorite scare zone, Rob Zombie, Hell Billy Deluxe. Go. I wish it's not that chicken. 
I think it does at the beginning. Well, I think it's supposed to, but I wouldn't eat that chicken. Oh, uh, it takes off! So, a thousand corpses was just so good. I keep saying it, but it's my favourite house. Definitely my favourite house. And we were big fans of the film and of Rob Zombie before Horror Nights announced that we were going to do it. So, we've always loved it. But yeah, it's just so good. We're now heading, hopefully, towards Graveyard Games, one of the original houses. We've only been through it once, so looking forward to going through it again. Yes, I always find that I enjoy a house. Not the first time round, but maybe the second and onwards. I find the first time I'm always a little bit disappointed. But then after I've done it again, I love it. some killer clowns popcorn. Even got their own chocolate. What's in here? Cotton candy flavored with jelly beans. How much is that then? Four dollars each. I'm intrigued, I'd like to try it. Shop. It does smell really good in here. What are you fancy? No, I've never had a whoopie pie before. This is the chosen item. Well, I don't know where we left off, but we did the mummy twice. That was really, really cool. But now we're at International Drive again, and we're going to try Bahama Breeze. Never tried it before. I already know what I'm having now. Looked at the yeah. menu. Yes, has been looking at the menu already. Yeah. I think it'll be a nice place to eat. It always looks nice when we go past and busy. Coming up to Parrot's Cove Adventure Golf. We did this two years ago and it was a lot of fun. I wouldn't do it in the day because it would be seriously hot, but of an evening it was like a nice 45 minutes. Lovely. I feel like we've been walking for ages. We have. <sighs> I didn't realise it was this far, but we, we're here now. I actually feel a bit giddy and giggly from how far we've got. Great busy, yeah, they better fit us in. Quite a fun menu, um, like obviously it has burgers, ribs, but I'm gonna go for this pasta, jerk chicken pasta. Scott, I think is gonna go for this honey sriracha burger. And uh, I'm gonna go for the lighter portion, where is it? The lighter portion, because I've got my eye on this. Oh, we did it again. I started eating without vlogging. Sorry, gang. So I went for the jerk chicken pasta with mushrooms and asparagus. And I've tasted it and it is so good. Scotty here has got the chicken sriracha burger. I have to say that was delicious. Scotty wasn't like bowled over with his. No, it was fine. It just didn't taste that much, really. It tasted like a chicken burger. Nothing very exciting, but very nice. And everybody else is enjoying theirs. I ordered this, but it didn't come with the eye patch or the flag. Got it. Well, they thought you were too old. Well, here it is. The rum and raisin cake. I'm going to try it. They're clapping for you and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh dear. Cold. Oh, yeah. That really hurt. <laughs> Sensitive teeth kicking in. 
I thought that would definitely return there. Bahama Breeze was lovely, wasn't it? And that rum cake was so good. Very nice. It wasn't heavy at all, it was so light. I'd have another. So thank you so much for watching. We hope you've enjoyed watching our day. We will see you tomorrow. I think we're going back to Ireland and Universal and then Horror Nights in the evening. So we'll see you tomorrow. And remember to like and subscribe. Bye.